Hello everyone, another game from uh, Ninja Chubs today in uh, Headquarters Pro in Underground. And uh, yeah, before we get started on our topic today, um, I need to give out a shout out. I need to uh, give a shout out to uh, three of my friends, uh, Jed Shears, Niall Beckingham, and uh, Nick Hurtley. I've got a funny story about Nick Hurtley in a minute for you. And I'll start with that story now. <laughs> right. In our school, I'm pretty sure it's the same in other schools, you get letters and that from teachers um, and bits and bobs. But yeah, year seven, maybe year eight, not a clue, walked into our classroom and said, is Neek Oatley in here? And my friend Jed Shears, which I'm giving the shout out to today, found it absolutely hilarious. I mean, his laugh was just terrible. He sat there squeaking. I mean, he found it so funny. Well, we all did, but um, I mean, this—he was like literally squeaking. I mean, his laugh was that bad. He was squeaking, and um, yeah, I just uh, give a shout out to them three, because uh, my uh, my friend Jed Shears asked me to, so I thought I would, and uh, yeah. So um, on to today's topic, which I can't remember. Uh, right, guns and noob levels. Okay, um, you you do get the odd person that does a game, and they they, they well not really a game. They do a video of um, like uh, how to speak. Say that they they give noob levels on it and what they think a noob level is. I know I've given two on um I think two yeah on Modern Warfare two. But yeah, I've seen I've seen two or three already on Modern Warfare three, and the one that uh, in three of the videos I've watched, I've seen that the Type ninety five has got ten for the noob level on three different videos, and these are three different guys, they're not the same person. I must agree that the Type ninety five is basically now the U the new UMP forty five. Because it's it's like normally with the M if you look at the M take the M sixteen for instance, that takes about two maybe three bursts to kill somebody. And if you've got impact on and you shoot them in the head, it probably take one. But a Type ninety five, you could put a suppressor on this weapon, and you'd still kill somebody in one burst. I mean, fair is fair. You've got to make them three burst guns a bit more powerful so they can kill people faster. But making it in one burst is too unfair. Um, another gun that's got a high level is in the UMP-45. We all know why that is. It's the same. That it takes like three, maybe four bullets to kill somebody. Maybe even worse. Even with the suppressor on. So yeah. Other ones are like things like Bouncing Bettys. They're like saying that it's like um, the noob. Like basically... I don't know, people just call it newbie. And yes, we do know that the underbarrels are back, and the most famous is the grenade launcher. Because we all know how newbie that was in Modern Warfare 2, like killing people over the map, but it is a bit different in um, Modern Warfare 3. Because uh, in this, it's a lot harder to kill people in one shot. I, mean, I wouldn't say a lot harder, but it's a bit. Because you will not, all, you you won't always kill them in one clean shot. If you hit them in the body, maybe. But yeah. And um, yeah. So talking about the another topic for today, but the, I'm gonna say this is the main topic now. I mean that was just the random one. The main topic of today, the Xbox dashboard. Right, it was either released early this morning or yesterday. I think it was yesterday though, because my friend Drew got it yesterday. I um downloaded it about a half an hour ago, and it looks pretty cool from um, what I've looked at so far. I mean, I haven't completely gone through it yet. I've only been look. I've only looked at the first two things, just home and social. I haven't looked at um all the other ones yet, so I still need to explore all that. So yeah, it, it looks pretty cool. The, the social thing looks quite cool because you have like your avatar and you've got all them stupid symbols. I think they're achievements in game. So, um, yeah. 
you you it looks pretty cool and I, I might go through I might do a video later on on uh, something I mean I don't know how I'm gonna survive this I've got to try and do 19 minutes of commentating this is just terrible so yeah um comment rate and subscribe at the moment are kind of low and just like my views as well I mean, I know it says on my channel that I've got like 300 and something odd views, but I mean, it's, it's not too great. But anyway, I mean, it's better than a couple of my friends have. So, um, yeah. Uh, uh if you want to check out my friend's YouTube channel, he's the Random Jed, is the, the, the shout out that I'm putting, that I'm giving to today. He has a YouTube tan channel. That's, I was about to say channel then. Yeah, he has a YouTube channel. And um, obviously the random Jed. If you want to go check him out, fair enough. And um, yeah, so uh, it's um, yeah, that's pretty much everything. But I'm not gonna end it there because that would be so boring. But yeah, if um, if you guys, guys who do view this, can you put in a a comment or message me or something? Asking on what things you want me to discuss on my next video, because I mean it's always stuff that I'm coming up with, and it's a bit boring hearing it from the same old person. Because yeah, if you have any topics that you want to discuss or you want me to talk about, uh, leave a comment and I'll surely do that for you. So yeah, coming back to um, uh, the dashboard. Um, I was I was saying something and I forgot. Um, I have forgotten. Do I remember it? Yes, I do. Yeah, um, yeah, I might do a video tomorrow or later on, most likely tomorrow or the day after that. I don't know. But yeah, I'll probably do a, a video of what things are there and what you can do on it if you guys want me to. If you honestly don't want me to and you think it'd be a waste of time, then just leave that in the comment in the comments box. Uh, subscribers, I think I have like four, and I subscribe to like 150 million people. <laughs> Not literally that amount, I can always find out and I'll tell you in my next video. But anyway, yeah, I, I did 41 to 21 in this game uh, using the, adva the advanced UAV stealth bomber and the MP, which is my normal setup for people who viewed my other videos. Um, Using the ACR with extended mags, gold camo, obviously, and with the FMG9 akimbo, I think, or is it the Stinger? I think it's the Stinger in this game. Uh, it's the FMGs in the game I did after this. I can't remember either way. But yeah, so um, I'm not sure what I'm on now. I mean, if guys have been counting, good for you. The oh, there's Stealth Former. This is my first set of kill streaks, I think. I like get all of them twice. Oh, what the fuck's he doing? But yeah, I'm always dead. But yeah, got to mind the swearing. <laughs> the people who are the, the little children who view my videos. I know that sounds like that probably sounds a bit pedoing, but oh well. But um, anyway, going back on to tactics and stuff like that, I'm. Somebody asked me the other day what they could do for tactics. I am probably not the best person to talk to. You're better off talking to a rat than you are talking to me. Because tactics, my straight tactics are just run out, get kills. If you find a good spot where no one's getting you, at least for a while, stay there for a bit. Also known as camping slash defensive playing or cautious, cautious playing. But anyway, I got, yeah, I, I did get him in the head eventually. But yeah, another another round about like ten minutes to go, I think. But that, there's my first EMP. I do get two in this game, like I have said. But yeah, right. Let's go on to the game type I'm doing. Headquarters. Um, it's very. I would say it's a very fast-paced sort of game. Mid, like mid range of um, like sort of medium range sort of it's depending on what map you're on I mean it's, it's not always like combat around every corner it's like you're getting shot at by somebody or you're shooting someone but 
it, it pretty it is pretty much fast paced and adrenaline rush. But um yeah, I mean smaller maps like um, Dome, that's even worse because there's an enemy literally round every corner you go and you're pretty much gonna get killed by everyone. But yeah, anyway. Other right, the, the, I actually I think I'll ask this now. So later, I'll probably forget. Yeah. Um, if you guys don't like headquarters that much, because that's the only game type I do. If you want me to go on to something like Search and Destroy or Team Deathmatch, Deathmatch, Team Deathmatch, um, leave it in the comments or send me a personal message either way, and I'll start doing that for you. But I probably I won't be able to do like a hundred of each. You know, if somebody will tell me to do this, I'll do one game of that, and somebody else do something else, that, something else, and I'll do one of that, and I'll just do one of each game type I see. I mean, free for all, it's not my sort of thing, but I'll still do it. But yeah, anyway, back on to the game. I've actually worked out that I've got, I've got ten assists by the end of this game. I mean, I didn't count. I'm looking at um my score now because this isn't a live recording as uh, one of my one or two of my other videos have been but anyway yeah I sort of like sway through live or live and like set up recording sort of stuff but anyway but yeah oh hold on let's turn on my TV anyway I just gotta quickly send my friend a message two seconds But, um, yeah, um, I, I hope to be getting some more games soon. Um, I'll stick them on for you, talk for people and stuff like that. And, um, whatever else. If you guys want to, want me to do, do some stuff for you, like, um, recommended classes, anything like that, recommended classes, recommended tactics, lay down of the maps, different shortcuts and stuff like that you can take. Making your gameplay easier or making it harder on your enemies. Either way, just let me know and I'll put it in the video for you. Uh, so yeah, I've pretty much got everything down. But um, my friend Jed, the person I was um, gave the call out to, has asked me to try and keep commentating through all my games. So I'm going to try to do it. It's not long now. It's about six minutes. Oh no, maybe more. Oh, sorry, I was. I just went too quiet. But anyway, yeah. Right. The topic of the year. I'm joking. Right. One thing my friends have been talking about, or one of my friends, he's Ginger, and my friend Jed will probably know who this is. Uh, his name's Matthew, and he's completely obsessed with Just Cause. And he's probably, he said that he's hoping for a Just Cause 3, but I mean, for you guys who haven't played Just Cause 2, it's, it's alright, I mean, for the strategic players and people who like free roaming like I do, you guys are sort of like that sort of stuff. I mean, if you're, if you're like, Call of Duty fans and, like, shooting, and you want to get the stuff sort of, like, done, and you don't like free roaming and stuff, then it isn't really your type of game. But, yeah, either, either way, it's, it's a good game, but, I mean... The only downside to it is there's no multiplayer. It's just normal free roaming and single player. It's kind of boring that way. And if they made it a bit more like Call of Duty and put some multiplayer in it, it'd probably be a whole lot better. But we're not talking about that, we're talking about this. But anyway, back to some funny things. Oh right, I got a bit another a little funny story for you. Probably it's not probably not as funny as the first one, even though the first one wasn't that funny. Uh, in French, my last lesson of today, we my, my friend was talking about can you get nits in your armpit hair? 
as I know, it's, it's a bit disgusting. But he thought he'd ask our teacher. We had a supply teacher named Mr. Williams. And, uh, yeah. Then, my friend Jed, which I keep relating back to, said, I just wash my pubes or something like that. I didn't quite clearly get all of it. But he said, no, I just give my armpit hair and my pubes a bit of a wash. And then, our other teachers is sort of like a teacher's assistant sort of like thing named Helen. She's proper friends. She like looked at him as to think, what the hell are you on about? And we, we, it was quite funny. He did his squeaky laugh again. It wasn't as funny as the first time. But anyway, so yeah, it, it was quite weird. And uh, as, as we were thinking, is it can you get crabs on your pew? Uh, no, not on. Yeah, obviously you can on your pews. Yeah, but but can you get it on your armpit hair? That's what we were wondering. I mean, it could be possible, but you never know. But anyway, so yeah, just a, a really disgusting topic for you guys to think about, whether you can get crabs in your heart. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, the game is almost over. Uh, it's about two minutes, something like that left. Yeah, two minutes now. No, two, yeah, two minutes. Keep thinking I'm saying two seconds. Anyway, yeah. The if 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 you are wondering why, oh damn! I've got to watch this. I, I can't remember watching this one. Oh, not bad. No shape. Yep. Yeah. If you're wondering why uh, at some points I'm consistently hit, consistently hit firing, it's because I'm trying to get steady aim, so I can stop using it, because I really don't like it. This is a bit newbie. I got a little bit of a triple there. It was a double, but it should have been a trip. Oh yeah, and here's my second load of kill streaks. Advanced UAV, my stealth bomber, and now I only need two more for my EMG or EMP. Thought I'd mix that up a little bit. Not seeing PMG. <laughs> but anyway, oh, another little funny story. There's three in one game. Oh my god! Right. I don't know about other people in schools. We we have to do this thing in Dragon's Den. If you go to my school, if you go to Well Community School, you'll get what I mean. And um, yeah, we have to do this thing called Dragon's Den, where you make an invention that hasn't already been made, and you try to sell it to these four good people that came in. But anyway, uh, yeah. So um, anyway, in uh, my tutors um presentation the girl that was doing ours we, we don't know if he meant to do this or was it was part of it or was it was just accidental it was most likely accidental but she actually she's accidentally swore in it it's like oh no Pete, th this is true i mean when you're in the cinema and people are sat there rustling around and stuff and she was like i oh, know it's like i get pissed off and this and that and you we were all just sat there thinking oh my god did she actually just do that <laughs> Did she actually just swear in front of four judges on this on Dragon's Den? Are you serious? So yeah, we were all a bit gobsmacked, and our friend Jed thought is like, he was a bit like, "Oh my God, you you let us all down. We're so upset with you right now. You're a complete waste." So um, yeah. Anyway, back to the game. Um, not long left, about 23 seconds, so I'm going to go ahead and finish it up here, I mean if you want to watch the rest of it, fair enough, you don't, we, we lose anyway, oh yeah, you see us lose now, but um, yeah, comment, rate and subscribe, and I hope my three friends like that I gave them a shout out, so um, goodbye everyone.